U.S. Army's Dark Eagle long-range hypersonic weapon, is about to ready in six months. The U.S. Army intends to convey the primary live test fire of its hypersonic missile Dark Eagle, long-range hypersonic weapon, in about six months. The Army's Rapid Capabilities and Critical Technologies Office has been quickly fostering the land-based, ground sent off long-range hypersonic weapon, one of the main 35 modernization needs, fully intent on sending a functional capacity in monetary 2023. We begin conveying those live test fire, I'll just generally express, in around a six months, Lieutenant General Neil Thurgood said during a show at the Space and Missile Defense Symposium in Huntsville, Alabama. Furthermore, as we finish that plan of the actual round, is there a risk related with that? Absolutely. Can we afford to wait? Absolutely not. Last September, the Army conveyed the hypersonic battery to fighters with I Corps 5th Battalion, 3rd Field Artillery Regiment, 17th Field Artillery Brigade at Joint Base Lewis M.C. Cord, Washington that gear incorporated a battery tasks focus, for carrier erector launchers and change trucks and trailers. Every launcher holds two rounds. Conveying the gear over a year in front of the live adjusts has permitted soldiers to get an early advantage on preparing, remembering stacking and emptying the hardware for C-130 airplanes. Most as of late, the unit finished a reproduced live-fire occasion with U.S. Indo-Pacific Command and the theater fires focus to work on managing the fire's kill chain going through it multiple times. Traditionally in materiel programs, you kind of have the Big Bang Theory produce everything, get everything in place and give it to the unit. We didn't, Thurgood said. We chose a different approach, get the unit ready, train to get them to use it and then eventually give them live rounds. The Dark Eagle long-range hypersonic weapon, which can fly no less than 1,725 miles, is essential for the Army's long-range fire's modernization need, alongside the precision strike missile, extended-range cannon artillery and mid-range capability. The Army is collaborated with the Navy on the common hypersonic glide body, which the Sea Service will use for its conventional prompt strike hypersonic weapon. The Navy will handle its most memorable live adjusts in fiscal year 2025 as the Army purchases its second Dark Eagle long-range hypersonic weapon battery. The Army mentioned $249 million in Dark Eagle long-range hypersonic weapon acquisition financing in its fiscal year 2023 spending plan, to help creation of the second battery of the long-range hypersonic weapon not later than the final quarter of fiscal year 2025. The long-range hypersonic weapon program is planned to change to the Army's Program Executive Office Missiles and Space Procurement Office in fiscal year 2024. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.